Here we come! Okay. <laughs> hey, feeling good, like I should. When in Durku, I'll go around the neighborhood. Feeling blessed. What's up, what's up, guys? It's Mariana back with another video. And I know it's not Thursday, but I thought it would be better timeline wise to upload this video on Saturday. I have less than 24 hours before my family comes to get me for vacation and I have not gotten ready at all. For this week's video, I have laid out a short, easy, get ready with me checklist for vacation that anybody can use. So kicking off right into it, our number one thing on our to-do list is go to Target. Anything you need, Target's got it. I went to Target today and only got the essentials. For example, I got this really cute little scarf. I can bring this on vacation with me. I can... <laughs> I can wear it any way I like, especially since, thanks to Hurricane Barry, it's going to be raining a lot the first few days that we're gonna be in Gatlinburg as a hat. Oh, a hat. over the shoulder. I can say though it is a little spicy and a little difficult to wear so whatever brand you get please be careful. The next essential that I bought from Target is <laughs> because we always get top priority stuff in this house. I think this was a really good purchase just because it's very easy to carry, easily packable, and all of this stuff, I can lug it wherever I want. It's travel sized, obviously, so I thought that was a have to for our Gatlinburg trip. The next essential that I bought from Target is this cute little playset. Now, Target did say this was for like cats and kittens and all of that stuff but what if I find a bear cub that I just want to take home he's gonna need somewhere to sleep something to play on and gnaw on so I thought this little cat tree house would be the best for the little bear cub that I'm going to be bringing home another essential that I bought at Target is something super cute and just in case when I'm in the mountains and I lose cell service and I need to find where I am a globe because you know what this thing will never run out of service i can always find where i am on here i'll always be able to find my way home for example right now i am here and that is accurate and the last most important essential that i bought is a whole human and i got to take it home with me and everything so this one can fit in my carry-on so that's where she's going to be staying so this is just in case if I get lonely or I need another vegetarian there with me. <laughs> easy to access. And if I can find the off button, that would be even better. Run along, little human. Go put yourself back in my carry-on. After you have gotten every essential that you need and only the essentials from Target, the next thing you gotta do is get your nails done. This task is super simple. It might cost a little bit more money than you originally thought it would, but yes, thank you. I know you got yours done too. It wasn't rolling. Oh, so this is the nail color that I got for this year's vacation. I'm super excited. I love it. Chic, ha. Huh. I also got a pedicure, so we're fresh and ready to go. And the next thing on our vacation to-do list is to try something new. And by that, I mean, dye somebody's hair. For example, my little human that I bought, I dyed her hair. My human's hair is now purple. Rolling off of that one into our next to do is get a tattoo. It's easy, it's simple, it's not cheap, it's sometimes a little painful, but hey, we're going on vacation, so why not? And if you wanna go the full mile, you can be just like me, and I got two. One on my left wrist right here that says 12. It's a little faded right now. I have to get it touched up in a week. And it's low key because my wrist was irritated. The tattoo artist said that my skin rejected the ink, but it's okay. 
So just a little backstory behind this. Nobody has to do this part of the to-do list, but 12 was actually my volleyball number when I used to play for eight years in competitive. But moving on to my next one is on my right forearm. It says Princess Buddy with a little crown. This one is a nickname that my grandfather used to call me before he passed away in 2015. Yes. All right guys, so we are nearing the end of our to-do list for vacation, but we are not done yet. One of the most important ones to do is dye your hair. Okay, so we have our fresh new hair color for vacation. And if you want to go the extra mile like I did, you can trim up your hair a little bit and give it something new. I've actually been picked up by my parents already. We are packed in the car and heading to our final vacation destination. Whoa, you saw how many words I just said? <laughs> so, I hope you found this short, easy to-do list to get ready for vacation that I created all by myself. I hope that you can find it useful and that you try it out one day when you're going on vacation because I did and it was a fun time. Anyway, that is all that I have for this week's video. This upcoming week, the vacation, huh? The vacation, <laughs> <laughs> this coming week, the vacation series starts 2019 in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Here we come! Okay. <laughs> so be sure to check in next Thursday when the vacation series starts. It will be the same thing as last year where I break it up into a couple weeks, a, a few days each video. I hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> like and subscribe down below. Oh my god, wait! If you want to come find and chat with me on social media in between my uploads, you can find me here on Instagram, Snapchat, and my website. <laughs> be sure to check that out. I will be posting fun and cute videos and pictures of me and my family while we were on vacation. So get fun, cute little behind the scenes updates.